AI is expected to produce 4.4 trillion annually by 2030. That's not just my estimate. I think one of them is by McKinsey, another one is by PwC. I think EY did their own estimate. So 4.4 trillion. In the context of the numbers we heard this morning, Amitav talked about 4.5 trillion, I think. Somebody else, if you go to green transition, that I think is 7 trillion. So 4.5 trillion is significant on an annual basis of what it can provide. Now, we have to build upon what there is. So if you listen to both what Shantanu said and what Chandra said, you need a digital infrastructure in place. Once you have it, what is it that AI can do? And for a moment, speaking as a non-technologist, it is going to take on certain low-level cognitive tasks and be able to amplify them and do them. So when you can do that, you make everyone more productive. As you make people more productive, in effect, you have more workers. If you have more workers, then you are actually generating more capita GDP in each nation. So as we go back to the very beginning of B20 about inclusion, then that is a way to make the GDP grow faster across all of these countries. And our goal should all be how do we make secure and accountable AI that can go benefit the productivity of enterprises and governments to talk about some of the use cases that everyone here spoke on.